The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is up guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden Mobile video. Guys, today we have new packs in the game and new items in the game as well. We have a throwback uh, promo that's going on right now. So basically what this says, guys, there's a Ravens Anquan Bolden, a Seahawks Byron Maxwell. Um, there's also a Clay Matthews 95 overall in here as well. So um, pretty beastly items. I mean, this Clay Matthews has 91 speed. That's pretty damn good for a middle linebacker for sure. Um, and guys, what right now you can do, you can go in and if you take a look at these things here, if you complete them, you do get a chance at some throwback items. So uh, what we're going to do today, though, guys, is they did also add new packs to the game. So we're going to go in and take a look at those real quickly. There you have it, the throwback packs. These are going to contain one throwback item, four gold or better players, and more. The offer ends 317. So... As far as I understand, guys, I believe, and don't quote, don't quote me on this, but I think DeMarcus Ware is still in packs. Now, yes, I did actually end up selling my DeMarcus Ware. You guys see up there in the top right-hand corner. I've got 20 million coins right now on Madden Mobile. we got a lot of coins here on Madden Mobile, which is nice. Uh, but, you know... It was one of those things. I felt bad about doing it because, like, I really wanted that card, of course. But um, I also didn't really want to just sit there and have it burn a hole in my pocket, essentially. Because when you're playing, like, head-to-head, -head, uh, basically, you're not playing defense. So, now, granted, your opponent's playing your defense... But, I don't know. For me, I just... I prefer to open packs. I have a lot more fun doing that. Um... I have a whole bunch of other random stuff in here to open up as well. Let's see here. I got some like elite campus hero players. Maybe I'll open up those in the next couple of days here. Uh, but we've got these throwback packs here today, guys. I did get 20 of them. So we're going to go ahead and open up the throwback packs today, boys. And also, I believe I hit 100 quick sells to do. So we're going to do with some quick sells, guys. And so the first thing that we get in these packs here looks like a throwback snapshot. Now, I'm not really sure what these are. Uh, looks like that you're going to have to add them to either get some throwback gear or you can add them to players. So let's see here. Trade in five throwback snapshots, one throwback cleats collectible. So, okay, so you need to have the the actual, like, um, equipment or whatever, just like on Madden console, so that you can actually complete these sets to get these players, it looks like. So that's kind of interesting. It looks like that the, um, yeah, okay. So it looks like probably that the collectibles, like the, the gear, are probably worth a little bit more if you were to break it down. But, you know, that's not that bad, though. And then you do actually have to add a bunch of elite trophies as well. Thankfully, I have some elite trophies. So I have to think about which one of these that I want to do because I should be somewhat close to getting at least one of them at the end of this video so um we'll hold on to these collectibles for now and i want you guys to let me know in the comment section below which one of these players should i go after it looks like they're probably all going to contain the same things so unfortunately we're not going to get any uh throwback elite players it doesn't look like out of these packs at least that i can tell so right here we did get a helmet it looks like so you can add this to any of the sets each set is going to need one of these helmets it appears yeah, so, um, so again, these are probably going to have some value. You do, uh, you can also add, like, the other collectibles, it looks like, to get um, gear, which is nice. So, you know, you don't just have to, to uh, hold on to those collectibles and put them in the sets. You can actually also change them. Oh, we did get a bunch of elites here. Here we go. We got an AJ Green. We got a Muhammad Wilkerson. Neither of those cards are probably worth a whole lot right now. Uh, but like I was saying, if you add 10 of these snapshots, you are going to get one of the gear. So, again, it looks like those things are basically what 10 times as expensive or so um, or as valuable I should say but uh, we'll continue on here guys just to let you know <clears throat> uh, if I do end up pulling another DeMarcus Ware I'm gonna have to like think about what to do with him because like I, I really don't know we did get a Greg Olson here and we got another uh, pads collectible shoulder pads collectible so that's nice but man if I get another one I don't even know I, I might just have to keep them because like I mean that would almost be sacrilege for me to have Two, two DeMarcus Wares and then neither of them on my team. But <laughs> I don't know, man. So we get another snapshot here. Unfortunately, that pack not worth a whole lot. These things go for 50,000 coins, guys. So this is like a, basically a 2 million coin pack opening. Do get another Elite here with Tom Baha Lee. But it uh, doesn't look like we're pulling anything super crazy out of these anyway. 
but uh, hopefully we can get some more of those like shoulder pads and like the cleat. We need the cleats, I think, right now is what we need. If we get the cleats, we should be getting pretty close. Oh, snap! We just pulled a freaking 95 overall Marshall Yanda fan favorite hero edition. Oh my gosh, man. That is a nasty pull. Woo! Let's go, baby. 95 overall. That is huge, man. That's definitely going to be an upgrade for my team. So that is definitely a big, big card to pull. I don't know what this thing's going for right now. 95 overall, I would presume, is going for a decent amount. But that is a really nice pull either way. Even if it's not going for a lot, I'm very, very happy about that. So we'll have to go in after this, take a look and see if it's worth it for me to hold on to it or for me to sell it. But uh, let's continue to rip through these packs here, guys. Man, we got some good pulls lately. Seriously, anytime that you're pulling like 95 or above overalls, that's always nice. That is always freaking nice. And then guys, if you didn't know, in the last video, yes, I've mentioned it a couple times here. Uh, the last Madden Mobile video that I did, I actually did pull the 99 overall DeMarcus Ware. So you're going to want to go back, check that one out. Pretty unexpected reaction from me. So uh, yeah, I was, I was very happy about that. We did get another Elite there with Lane Johnson. We're down to six more packs to go, guys. So let's rip through these fairly quickly here. And if you guys are enjoying these large pack opening videos, there we got the cleats. So let's go so now let's see here uh, if you guys are enjoying these videos by the way make sure you drop a like and subscribe let's go in and take a look here and see what these things require a cleats a shoulder pads a helmet and six elite trophies so right now I believe I can either complete one of these already or else I'm very close obviously I need the elite badges but I already have those so that shouldn't be an issue so again let me know in the comments section below which one of these I should complete and I will go ahead and do that for the next video that you guys can see um, so we did get cleats again. So maybe we'll actually be able, be able to get close to getting two of these complete. That would be nice. That would be very, very nice. We get cleats again. Weird. Three in a row after not getting them for the first, what, 15 packs. We didn't get any of those. But we get three in a row. And then we get shoulder pads. So this is, this is a good run here of getting good collectibles at least to finish these sets. And uh, we get another snapshot there. So I wonder if the snapshots are actually like the same likelihood to be pulled as all the other ones. That's what it kind of seems like right now. Um, but yeah, I mean, that would be interesting because then you're going to have to take those other things like the shoulder pads and stuff like that and turn them into, um, these snapshot collectibles. So anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure that you drop a like on it. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And don't forget to let me know in the comments section below which one of these throwback players should I get. Should I go with Clay Matthews, Anquan Bolden, or Byron Maxwell? Let me know in the comments section below. And we'll have that in a future video for you guys. Thanks so much. And I will talk to you guys again soon.